Hey, how's it going? Today I'm gonna to go over how to draw a Rudolph drawing. It's gonna be just Rudolph's head. Um, it's gonna be real simple, easy, and for beginners. So as far as the Christmas stuff goes, uh, you're in the right place. So let's get started. First thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna be uh, telling you what I'm gonna use. I'm using this Crayola brand marker. Uh, it's gonna be the black one, and I'm also gonna use this red one for the nose. So we're the only part of the color in this drawing is gonna be the nose. Um, Paper-wise, this is computer drawing paper. It's really simple, um, you know, to buy, really cheap. If you want a supply list, I put that stuff in the description. That's the stuff I recommend. Um, but you can use anything you want. It's, there's no, you know, you can use whatever. Anyways, let's get started. First thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna actually start with Rudolph's nose. So let me see, what shape do I want? All right. I'm gonna pick this sideways egg shape. I think that's kind of a cool, um, I think it's just like a cool shape, to be honest, for a nose. I'm gonna pull another round shape, and that's gonna be kind of for the mouth area. All right. Draw like a mouth here, maybe like a smiley. And I'm gonna draw lines up here, up here, right here, side here. Uh, I'm gonna draw the side of the head there. And I'm gonna draw this kind of eye, and I always say this, I'm gonna draw hee hee eye, hee hee. You know, it's like a, it's just a, all it is is a curved line. All right, I'm gonna pull this up a little more, and I'm kind of deciding if I want, I don't want a hat on him on this one. I was gonna say, should I put a hat on him? No, I'm good. I'm gonna pull a line upward here and pause it, upward here and pause it, upward here. Now I'm gonna draw a stick over here and a stick over here that's gonna be for starting at the antlers. Stick over here, another line right here. Start out the antlers on the uh, antlers on the other side. Pulling a line in, pulling a line in. I'm gonna complete the curvature of the head. Also, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. If you like learning just a little bit about drawing, a little bit more about drawing every single day, um, you know, hit that subscribe button right now. Don't forget about it, don't do it later. Just right now, hit that subscribe um, so that it will let you know when I post a video. I'm posting three videos every single weekday. And basically that is 15 videos per week. That's a lot of videos. They're all for beginners, all beginner lessons. and. Uh, don't worry, it's not gonna overwhelm your feed. It's not gonna like, you know, it's probably gonna tell you about every third video, honestly. And then it's up to you for, to decide whether you wanna watch more. Um, but there's no downside, it's completely free. It helps the algorithm here for us. And in general, if you like, if, if my stuff is good enough for you to watch, um, then please consider subscribing. Uh, but yeah, all right, let's keep, continue going here. Curve over here for one ear out. It's gonna come to a point. Pull back in. That's gonna make him look like a deer and not just some like clown, you know? <laughs> the ear there and the antlers. Curl here, in. Pulling a line in, out. Pulling a line in, inward. Outward, down, and that's gonna be one of the side of the antlers. Outward here, down, other side of the antler. There, 
So now you have one of his antlers. On the other side, I'm gonna actually try to duplicate that same shape. So it's gonna have three prongs. You can draw four, you can draw as many as you want. I just kinda like the way this looks. I think it looks organized. It's like two in the side and one in the middle there. And next thing I'm gonna do is I'm going to fill in the nose with the, remember the red that we had? I'm gonna fill in the nose. First thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna draw a circle shape here and that's gonna be for a highlight. Just a circle, any circle, doesn't matter. Or an oval, anything. And I'm gonna fill in outside of that and that's gonna give you way more of a, oh, that's Rudolph, you know, kind of feel. Oh, hey, that's Rudolph, what up? What up, Rudolph? Yeah, what up, Rudolph? Yeah, ooh. Alrighty. And the last thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna thicken the, the outside contour lines with my black marker here. I'm gonna thicken that because I want it to look like a sticker. I just like that look. And it just looks better, I feel, and more organized when the outside line is super thick. Just continue. While I'm doing that, I'll talk to you a little bit. Uh, if you're really hardcore on drawing, like you really, really want to learn drawing inside out, like portraits and all of that stuff, uh, I have entire full courses on Skillshare right now. So courses by that, like each one of them are like an hour long, and it's like how to draw the head, the eyes, how to draw anatomy, how to draw um, anime, how to draw perspective. All that stuff is on my Skillshare. So go to that link below. The only issue is you're going to have to find it because... I have a bunch of links down there, but go to the Skillshare one. And right now, when you do that, you can get my courses completely free. So when you sign up for Skillshare, it gives you free Skillshare for two months um, currently. But, uh, and then you can see everything I have completely, completely free, like hours of content. If you're really hardcore about the whole, you know, learning, drawing inside out thing, um, not everyone is, you know, like uh, as far as that goes. Um, but yeah, consider that uh, if you do have, I guess, the time to do that. Uh, otherwise, uh, there's one thing you can do for the channel if you do like, it, appreciate me here on this channel. The one thing you can do that helps this channel out more than anything, more than anything, is sharing a video. When you share a video, it brings this huge, huge positive boost to the channel. It's so unbelievably obvious. I know it's hard for to see that, I guess, but for me, looking at the analytics and stuff, it's like, whoa, this is wild. Somebody must have shared a video because there's all these super like new people that are super nice in the comments. And it's just like a this awesome boom that makes me feel amazing. Um, and it just makes this stuff worth it because I love the drawing. Like I say in every video, I love, love the drawing and the teaching. What I don't like is I have to edit the video and I have to write all the descriptions every day. And that stuff, I don't like <laughs> that much. It's just kind of a hassle. Um, and it just makes that stuff worth it when I know people are like, listening. It's not just, oh, you know, I'm not talking to an abyss. I'm not talking to nobody. I'm actually talking to, wow, like a lot of cool people. So anyways, that is it. Thank you so much. I appreciate you very much. So if you got to this point, say hi in the comments and I'll know that you got to this point. I'll be like, oh, cool. You got to this point. That is it. I will see you in the next video. Merry Christmas. Uh, this has been Easy Pictures to Draw.